I'm Sir Tap Tap, and this is Bean. Think about those beans. This is a little visual novel thingy. You find a stray cat. It's magical. That's what it says. So let's find that cat. I hope that Red Bull is still in my system. What, what is this? Um, Death Stranding? Meow. Wait, was that Kermit? Meow. Probably a cat. That's totally a cat, right? I've had a decent number of cats in my life. That's a cat. I'm I'm weak and lame. I'll just run home. You run home like the loser you are. You spend the rest of your life thinking about that one cat you were too cowardly to check out. Loser ending. <laughs> Great game already. Amazing. Can I auto skip? I skipped the thing. Check it out. Cats are awesome. Wow, it's time to head out this unsketchy alleyway. It seems pretty safe. It's got cats in it. It really does seem safe. I guess no music in this. Oh, find a cardboard box. In it you see, sweet Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Kitty! Aw. Really, really cute kitten. Baby. Meow. Leave it then, just kidding, take it home. Monster. <laughs> take it home. Take the baby home. Gingerly you scoop the little dude into your arms and you sprint home. I've already decided you'd die for some, this fuzzy bingus. Is that the sequel to Screamy Bingus? It's got, an, it's got an outfit now. Finally, your own dry home. Can we grab the kitten in a cat pattern towel? Grab the first cat plushie you see. I'm sensing a theme here. I like this art style though. Moral support in these trying wet times. Would you like a bean in these trying times? What now? Uh, let's do a save here. Um, return, yes. Make one in post. I already did all that. Just pet the little guy. More moral support. Yeah. You pet the kitten. So soft. You're so beautiful. That is the appropriate reaction to a cat. Make one in posters. Super cute gender unknown. How, how, how do you not know how to check the sex of a cat? It's not hard. Is it lost? Posters not wanted. Oh well. <laughs> wanted! We're found? Question mark. I like the rainbow. X's. Use your extreme art skills, wit, and appeals to pathos to create a good wanted poster. Damn, you're responsible. Um, check them for injuries and tags. Okay, little guy, let's see. No tags, collars, or anything of the sort. Good news, you found no injuries. Find the fur is sleek yet soft. A perfect specimen of kitten. Stray cats usually have pretty rough fur. That's one of the easiest ways to tell if either an owner is neglecting or if a cat is, in fact, a stray. The cat, the the fur is usually pretty rough. Neutral news. You can't figure out its gender. Maybe just dumb. <laughs> no, it's perfect. I already did all that. Cat presses his little nose in your hand. You start crying. Just a little. Aww. Maybe you won't get rid of it. Maybe you just keep it and you'll be best friends and you won't be lonely anymore. <gasps> oh, Christ. The cat swirls in purple mist cover entirely. Its silhouette morphs as if transforming. Is this like the princess and the frog? Is magic real? Is this your true love? You'll settle even just for a regular friend. This is awesome. The mist clears. And it's... It's a little cat. But slightly bigger. Oh. Oh! It's got purple eyes. Oh, it's got heterochromia. That's how you know it's magic. <laughs> oh, it's got two tails, too. It's got blushy, blushy face. Two tails unfurl from behind the cat, which is exactly one, one, more than normal cats have. I see. Really? I'm a magic cat, and you have the gall to sound disappointed? It talks too? Oh, rad. That's better. Look at that pointy chest. <laughs> Just looking at me. Uh. Sorry for trying to find your junk earlier. Oh yeah, humans are your session with gender is fine. We don't use those, they're sort of inconvenient. Well, I gotta... Okay. How do, how do you exist? What's your name? I will say, a little bit of music would be nice. I have, you know, my... Oops, hello. My sound is on and everything. It's just... Yeah. What's your name? Uh... First, never call me little guy. Second, my name contains syllables that humans can't comprehend. So if you take those out, it sounds like bean. Oh, I'm thinking about those beans. Bean! Wait, are you crying again? Yes. 
Wait, how do you exist? Like, in general. Okay. Didn't really <laughs> mean to reveal myself to you, but I feel obligated. Since you helped me, I was sent here by my boss <laughs> to see if I could find a reliable source of sacrifices for our group! No! Oh no, bad cat! No, 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 bad. Missing two lobes and an eye. What do you mean? You only have two eyes. Mine are cooler than yours, though. Wow, rude. <laughs> you grumble is super right. I'm out of questions. Do you have any possible sacrifices? I need one so I can get contract with my crew. Do they have to be alive? Of course they have to be alive. Wait, unless you can trip them and show you with a decoy. I just need to make a report anyway. No big deal. And Bean looks around the apartment quickly. <gasps> okay. The boss probably wouldn't notice. Use it like a rock. That'd never work, you silly. Okay, we have to sacrifice Mr. Kiddums. You're interrupted really by Bean mercilessly tearing the head off the plush. Oh no! Bean, no! Patrick the Catrick, no! Let's go. I don't like this cat. I'm still numb from the recent loss of your dearest friend. You can only mindlessly trail after Bean as they lead you somewhere. This place somehow looks even more sketchy than the last alley. Apart from that though, it just seems like your average dirty alleyway. Bean immediately gets to work and pulls something out of somewhere. <laughs> oh, nice circle. Hail Satan. Bean makes a noise best described as ch. Oh, but yeah, there's, there's a lot of free music, and I mean, even for a short little project like this, like, Kevin McLeod has, like, a billion free songs and stuff you can use, um, and there's a whole bunch of places you can get stuff. Just, just anything, honestly. I, I particularly feel bad about not having music, because, like, it makes me feel like I should never stop talking, and, <laughs> yeah, it's just weird when you're doing a video. This is not a circle, but it is, though. Don't even start. Directing their attention away from you, they place the freshly slain Pat the Cat at the center of the circle. Start chanting some cool magic stuff you're interested but can't quite focus on what they're saying. So then you listen to a con conversation underwater with headphones on. Uh oh. This seems bad. <laughs> Perhaps this was a poor idea. If you had a chance to register, there's suddenly a flash of purple light and that alley is filled with more cats. I swear to God, these are not cats. Okay, quiet down. Here comes my boss. Please don't do anything stupid. That sounds like a good reason to save to me. <laughs> For the massive not cats in the back, uh, one crawls really, one really big one. Moves oddly, not like any animal you've ever seen before. Feels like maybe you don't belong in, in the world. It doesn't belong in the world. Looking at it gives you goosebumps. I've got goose pimples. Shh. <laughs> or chicken skin, if you prefer. If you're frickin' Howl from Pokemon. The little creature slinks to the center of the cir circle, sniffing at Pat. You bristle a little. Haha, <laughs> hey boss. Bean looks like they're about to spontaneously combust. Same. Big mood. Big mood. Sorry about the fake offering, but like, it's just your status report, so no biggie, right? <laughs> so like, wanted to say, no good source of sacrifices here, sorry we're gonna have to look somewhere else. Where? Huh? Fast and you can register this creature's suddenly in front of Bean, who is exponentially more terrified by the second. It's crazy looking the creature's eyes, because it's barely containing itself from doing something. Where did you get this from? Um, I made it! Bean looks equal parts confused, relieved, and are you kidding me? You're gonna die a painful death. <laughs> this otherworldly look of disappointment and disgust, I love it. Slowly, the being turns to face you. You feel your fight-or-flight reaction starting to kick in. You also can't decide which eye to look at. <laughs> you made this. Yep. This thing is gonna kill you, no question. At least you'll get to see Pat the Cat soon. Aw. I... I love it. Oh, yay! The face seems to literally split apart into an eerie grin. The teeth look like it stuck actual knives into its mouth. Kitty. What? Make more, please. Its body looks unstable. Its form, this texture, it's perfect. Please, please, 
Uh, sure, no problem. Do I want a different color? They come in different colors! <laughs> okay. I like this guy. The being seems like it comes dangerously close to unraveling reality or something <laughs> before calling down. I'm sorry. I should introduce myself. I am... Your head is filled with that weird noise again, but you can make out some syllables. M mitten? You start crying <laughs> again. <laughs> you return home, followed by your entourage of magical not cats. You and Mitten hold a lovely conversation while Bean trails behind, very confused. Ah, Good ending! Good end. Bean. Alright. Uh, skip. <laughs> There's only like two options. I'll be the sacrifice. Just kill me. I'm a millennial. Just do it. Hold on, what? That's well, okay. I'm not saying no to a free sacrifice. Before you can even process what you just agreed to, Bean leads you off to some sketchy hallway. Or uh, alleyway, rather. Bean rolls the Circle, but you're ended up to die soon, so I'll cut you some slack. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You, you were serious about that? Uh, no, of course not. Hey, look behind you. Okay. You spin around and see nothing out of the ordinary. Just as you're about to open your mouth and say you don't see anything, you see a sharp pain in your back. Everything goes dark. Bad ending. <laughs> well, that was Bean! That was a free little, um, thingy on Ichio. I love Ichio. They're great. It's a great source of just fun little things. Uh, it's kind of the modern equivalent of, like, old Newgrounds with, you know, I mean, Newgrounds is still around, but if you just want to find some fun things to play for, like, five, ten minutes, um, you can find tons of free stuff, play a lot of it in your browser. And uh, the thing I love about Ichio is you can just go right and follow the developer right there. You can, you know, add your stuff to a collection. You can um, see the developer's other games. Where is the developer's name? <laughs> There's a developer log called I Love You All. Aw, you all my coob. Oh, it's just Bean. There's only Bean so far, but hey. Maybe there'll be more soon, and if there is, I'll find it, because I followed them on Ichio. So, link to the game in the description. Um, that was Bean. I'm thinking about it. Tap tap here. If you like the video, make sure to subscribe and leave a like if you want. I read every comment posted, so don't embarrass yourself. Social media links in the description, including my Patreon, and any relevant links to the game.